the story of miraculous recovery. Tonight, the Bernalillo County deputy shot and critically injured during an ambush in October threw out the first pitch at the Isotopes game. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain talked to Hopkins about why her throw was such a huge moment. Forget the first pitch. Just the act of walking out to center field is more than Deputy Robin Hopkins ever thought she'd be able to do. I can put one foot in front of the other. You know, what a blessing that is. So it seems so small, but that's... That's what's so awesome about it is, you know, just standing here with you. Last fall, Deputy Hopkins was critically injured when Christopher Chase went on a shooting rampage through the streets of Albuquerque. Shot in the right thigh, Hopkins underwent surgery after surgery to repair bone and muscle. She's getting ready for yet another procedure this summer. The length in my leg, I uh, lost. Uh, about 36 centimeters. But on Tuesday, it was all about her arm. And I'll transition and then. Damn. <laughs> Action 7 News got the chance to follow Hopkins and her family to Isotopes Park. Nerves weren't really a factor for the Marine. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm really excited. With the crowd cheering her on, Hopkins switched a crutch from her right arm to the left and with a strong wind up, did exactly what she wanted to do. <laughs> it didn't hit the ground. Yeah, got it into the catcher's mitt. My heart is just filled with gratitude. Um, it's been overwhelming and I look forward to going back to work and serving the community. It's been so great to me. Reporting from Isotopes Park, Laura Terrain, KOAT, Action 7 News. The town of Vaughn now has water again after another outage. Officials say yesterday machinery broke a water.